If you, like everybody here at the CBC, is anticipating the arrival of Spider-Man across the Spider-Verse and are excited just to see all the possible multiverse variants that could be showing up and holding out for a possibility to see Tom Holland, well, your chances of seeing him just improved vastly, I would say, because the producer of Across the Spider-Verse teased it. So this news comes at us directly from the producer of Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, Chris Miller. And he was in an interview with Empire Magazine, and they were talking up the vastness of the Spider-Verse and the multiverse that Marvel has. Of course, talking about upcoming projects and all that. And when they ask him specifically whether there is a chance and that there's any truth to the rumors of Tom Holland's Spider-Man appearing in the multiverse, he says, let's say anything is possible in the multiverse, end quote. Now, if you compare what they were saying other times when this was asked in regards to the first film and even early on in development of the sequel, they would say that that wasn't something that they would want to talk about yet or it wasn't something that they were looking at doing. But the messaging has obviously changed. And just recently, we talked about the fact that it looked like that Tom Holland and the video game versions of Spider-Man would be appearing, meaning the video game version of Spider-Man from Marvel Spider-Man, Miles Morales, you know, the PlayStation exclusive game that's also now out on PC, and that version of Peter Parker. So it looks like there's more chance now than ever, considering that they're no longer denying it or saying that's not what we're talking about right now. Instead, they're literally leaning into it, hey, Let's just say anything's possible. It's the multiverse directly responding to the question. I think, in my opinion, this is more or less them saying, look, the leaks are out there. There's already been plenty of teases. It's going to be happening somewhere, right? In one of these films, whether it's across the Spider-Verse or beyond the Spider-Verse, I think we can see that they're going to do this because, again, why wouldn't you? Live action exists in the multiverse that's spinning off of cartoons because it has to that's the point we even saw cartoon multiverse in doctor strange in the multiverse of madness so it only makes sense that we're gonna get here now how long it is and what they do with it again remains to be seen but i'm excited to see how they approach this and can't wait to see all these spider-men interact